Today I want to show you how to use this poisoned effect that I've seen used in some TV shows or movies or even music videos. And uh, it's very easy and quick, so let's get into it. First things first, let's create a new comp. And then you're going to bring in your footage. I got this on Pexels video. Open up your effects. I'm going to add a curves adjustment layer on this very quickly and add a, an S curve. The next thing you want to do is go down to your go down to your footage layer, control C, control V, and I'm going to rename this posterized. And the effect we're looking for is posterized time. Just type that into your effects. And under time, posterize time, I'm gonna grab that and put, drop it into my effects controls for the top layer. Adjust the frame rate here to one. And then change the blending mode. If you don't see the blending mode, toggle switches down here, just hit it once. And I'm gonna adjust this to screen. Now when I hit play, you'll see that the effect has taken place. And to adjust this, you can shorten the frame rate to make it faster or uh, you can switch these blend modes to give it a different look, a different effect. This is what it looks like with overlay. And once you're happy with the result, you can export it or add in a title like I'm going to do. And that's what it looks like with the title. So you see you can achieve this effect very quickly and sort of it gives you the illusion that someone's been poisoned. I have a little bonus tip for you. If you move the footage down just a few frames, you'll see that you're going to get a completely different effect where it's similar, but the posterized time is leading into the, the footage. So it's happening a little bit beforehand and you're sort of getting, yeah, just a different look. And that could be more desirable depending on what you want. And if you want to learn how to create this effect that I applied on the text, I'll leave a link down below and a card should pop up here to let you know where you can watch that. And there you go. It's nice and simple. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next one. <laughs>